In a devastating blow to Wales' hopes of qualifying for Euro 2024, they were held to a 1 to 1 draw in Armenia. Lucas Elorayan, who had previously haunted Wales, opened the scoring in the fifth minute. However, Wales managed to equalise just before half time with an own goal by Nair Technizian. This result does not benefit either team in their quest to secure a top two spot alongside already qualified Turkey, even if Wales manages to defeat Turkey in their upcoming match, it may not be enough if Croatia wins their remaining fixtures. If that happens, Wales will have to participate in the March playoffs. Unfortunately, Armenia's chances of securing a top two place are almost certainly over, unless Croatia experiences a major collapse. This match was crucial for Wales, as they were seeking redemption after their humiliating 4-2 defeat to Armenia in Cardiff five months ago. Additionally, Wales had never beaten Armenia in their three previous meetings, so they had to overcome historical odds as well. Wales entered the match with the same lineup that secured a stunning 2-1 victory over World Cup semi-finalists Croatia last month. Brennan Johnson, who missed that game due to injury, was on the bench after scoring his first goal for Tottenham. Armenia, ranked 95th in the world and 67 places below Wales, had nine players from the team that triumphed in Cardiff in June. Zelarayan and Grant Leon Ranos, who both scored twice in that match, were part of Armenia's starting lineup. Wales found themselves trailing early on after failing to deal with a corner. Zelarayan capitalized on the opportunity and placed the ball into the bottom corner with precision. Wales had some chances to equalize, with David Brooks firing over and Nico Williams seeing his effort deflected wide. However, Wales struggled to sustain attacks, and Armenia posed a threat on the counter. Bahan Baichikayan came close to scoring, but his chip hit the crossbar. Despite Armenia's pressure, Wales managed to equalize just before halftime when Technizian inadvertently directed the ball into his own net from a long throw by Connor Roberts. The second half saw Brennan Johnson enter the field, bringing a new dynamic to the game. The match became more intense, with both teams receiving yellow cards for fouls. Armenia continued to press, but Wales defended resolutely, with goalkeeper Danny Ward making crucial saves. In the end, neither team could find a winner, leaving Wales with a massive blow to their Euro 2024 qualifying hopes. They now face an uphill battle to secure a top two spot relying on other results and potentially facing the playoffs in March. It's a tough situation for Wales, but football is full of surprises. Let's see how they respond in their upcoming matches and if they can overcome the odds to qualify for Euro 2024.